Hi, in this video we're going to show you how to turn on the integration between QuickBooks and KeyPay. Once you've logged into your QuickBooks account, you may want to access the payroll component of your QuickBooks file, which is powered by KeyPay. In order to turn on the integration between QuickBooks and KeyPay, you'll need to click on the Employees tab on the left-hand side of your QVO dashboard. You'll then be presented with this screen where you'll simply need to click on Sign Up for KeyPay. You'll then need to complete the next three steps in order to enable the payroll. You can enter in the ABN and the number of employees in the business. You'll then see that the business name and the business legal name have been automatically transposed over from the QuickBooks setup. And then you can just enter in an address. Once you've entered those details, you can click on Next. The second part of the setup is the contact details. You'll need the contact name, email address and the contact phone number. Then you can just click on Next. And the last part of the setup is the payroll details. The first option here is to enter the standard work hours per day. The system will default set this to 7.6 hours per day but you can change that if required. The next option is when does your work week start and end? The system defaults this to Monday to Sunday, but again, there are some other options there if needed. And then you'll need to set how often you process your pay runs. So this is referred to as the pay schedule. We have three pay schedules available in KeyPay, which are weekly, fortnightly and monthly. We only offer the three pay schedules in order to stay in line with the ATO tax tables that are available. Any of these first three options here can be changed at a later date once your payroll file is set up. You'll then need to select the industry that your business belongs to. You've also then got the option to register for one of our weekly webinars that we run on getting started with KeyPay. If you've been given a promo code, you can enter that in there and then you simply need to just click on sign up. Your payroll is now enabled and you can go straight to your payroll dashboard by clicking on the go to dashboard option. And this is what your payroll dashboard will look like. From time to time, if there are any warnings or messages that we need to notify users about, we'll put up notifications on the payroll dashboard and that's what these are here. It's always a good idea to make sure that you go through and read those warnings to check if any of them require action from you. You then also got the five tabs across the bottom here, the employees tab. You'll find a list of all the employees in the business under this tab, the pay runs tab. You'll find a list of all the pay runs that have been processed in the business. The approved leave tab will show you a monthly view of all the approved leave for all the employees in the business. We've also got a reports tab, which will give you a full suite of all the reports available in KeyPay. And then you've got your payroll settings tab. This is where you can configure all the settings that are specific to your particular business. Then up in the top right hand corner is where you would go to process a new pay run. If you require further assistance with setting up your payroll file, you can access our vast knowledge base of articles and videos via our support widget. The little question mark down in the bottom right hand corner will give you a pop-up screen where you can enter in keywords for the topics that you need assistance with. You can also contact our support via email from the contact us option down in the bottom right hand corner. This email address is support at yourpayroll.com.au